I'm standing at the parking lot of Kong, Gongju and the Donghaksa Temple area. This is the parking lot by the private people. So they, strangely, they collected only cash, not credit card. It's something looks like a ridiculous for me. This is the small village approaching to the Tonghaksa Temple. As soon as this kind of a small shop finished, it would be a coming to the road of the Donghaksa Temple. This is the junction to starting or going to the Donghaksa Temple from here to the Kwanembo. Summit of the Kiryongsan Mountain is 4.1 km. But I have to still continue uh, passing through the small a uh, village shop. I don't know how long they will continue. This is the ticket booth. And I like to see where I have to go at this junction. This is the valley stream coming from the Gerongsan mountain. And this is the road going to the first of all reaching to the Donghaksa temple. Just the uh, few minutes before and after is a big difference. Few minutes before was uh, crowded and civilian polluted. There are many shops, but here it comes up the, I can feel nature view. There are some people walking on the street to go probably going to the temple. So this is the uh Tongha Kegok. Uh, for east of the Tonghak Valley. What they mentioned, this valley is 3.5 uh, Habawi, Hakbai Rock in the Kanembong Pass. This is the main entrance gate going to the Donghaksa Temple. I can see the season change. The color of the all the different species of the tree is start to change like a yellow, yellow green or a red or a brown. This is the map for the Kerungsan mountain. I'm standing in the somewhere in the middle. You can see you are here, red color in red. And from the that point, I'm further to the 
going to the left side and after Unsan waterfall I'll continue. I'm standing in junction uh, where they introduced 400 meter to the Tongaksa temple and the Kwanumbong, the peak or summit of Jeryongsan mountain is 2.8 kilometer. So I will take a left side road instead of right side passenger car road. going up probably that mountain pass by pass by the pavilion on the right side sitting in the Tongak Valley it looks very good matching together with the valley and around nature but I will keep continue going up through the, this valley all the road. This is the main temple of Tonghaksa. Uh, I'm going up through the stairs and to see what they are mentioned here. This is the hall of the main temple and this is the three-story tower or pagoda here and this is the next temple building this is the main building this is the main building I'm standing at the starting point of the valley uh, hike course or climb course from here. After a cross of the, this bridge, I will keep continue going up through the valley course. Here is uh, information. As you see in the red, you are here. From here to the Kwanambong Peak, 966 meter altitude is about 2 kilometers slightly above. After that, there is a choice. Either I can uh, get down through the Sambulbong Peak or straight, straight down through the same road where I'm ascending now. I will take a decision when I coming up to the summit. Here is a landmark clearly stating uh, up to the Kwanambong Summit, 2.1 kilometer, and uh, Unson waterfall is 900 meter, which means only I cover from the Tongaksa Temple 300 meter. So now I'm starting climb up through the, this road, walking on the deck road and cross over the small bridge 
of the valley stream and probably continue the road. This is the high, high sloped stairs where I'm climbing up. It's a really hard step by step up. This is the Unzon waterfall. Uh, unfortunately, raining was not recently not there, and the, so water flow is not so good enough. But still, there is a water flow, and this is the so nice view of the valley near to the Unsan waterfall. This is the explanation of the Unsan waterfall. Uh, this waterfall is the meaning of the uh, God and the sky. They came down here uh, play uh, confidentially at the, this waterfall and going back to the sky. This is the rest place at the Unzon waterfall area and uh, this is the landmark, one kilometer I have to take over up to the Kwanambong Peak, Kwanambong Summit, which means I walk up here so far 1.4 kilometer. I have to continue through the, this road. Most of the road are 70 or 80 percent, like this way. On the left, there is a stone tower, unknown stone tower. This is the stairs, arranged by the zigzag way. If they don't arrange the this stair, this kind of a stone Stone, like this way, is almost no way climb up. Fortunately, MPS, they arrange the, this kind of convenient way up. This is the junction where 100 meters to the Guanambong summit and this left side road is Yonchebong one kilometer. Here comes the information of the man where I am now. And after that I had to climb over.
this road, this road. I'm standing on top of the Keryongsan mountain. What they mention here, 766 meter altitude. But it's a very unfortunate. Dust level is very high, so visibility is very bad due to the this uh, dust cloud on the sky. This is the junction between the Sambulbong Peak Course and Donghaksa Temple Course, where I coming up this morning. Probably I will take the same road I coming up this morning, and through the, this course I will back to the parking lot. I'm standing at the observation to the Salgebong Peak. This is at the middle between the small uh, goji. That is a Salgebong Peak down below. Now this is the parking lot. I back to here after two hours descending from the summit.